To get things started, I just added some stock footage to my timeline. Let's begin by going to Title, New Title, Default Still. In the pop-up, select the Rectangle tool and draw one in the lower left area. Use the Color Picker box to change the rectangle's color. I'm also going to decrease the opacity of my rectangle to give it a slightly transparent look. Next, select the Text tool and type some text in the rectangle. I'm going to change my text color and increase its opacity so that it stands out. Okay, we're done in here, so go ahead and close the window. Drag your new title above your footage on your timeline. Make sure you have your title selected and then go up to Effect Controls. In here, we're going to add some keyframes to the position property and give our title a sliding animation. Move the time head a little to the right and then hit the stopwatch toggle to create your first keyframe. Then drag the time head to the start of your clip and adjust the horizontal position so that the title will start just off the screen. This looks good, but we need to add two more keyframes to have it slide back out. Hold down the Alt key while dragging the second keyframe to create a copy of it. Position it a little bit outside the end of your clip. Then hold down the Alt key while dragging your first keyframe and position it to the end of your clip. Okay, and now when we play this back, we have a nice looking sliding animation. But let's say you want the animation to look less stiff and more zippy. To do this, we're going to expand the position property and take a look at the velocity. Select the first keyframe and then drag the velocity point up. Then select the second keyframe and drag the velocity point down so it looks like a ramp. And we're going to do the same thing for the other side. Select the third keyframe and pull the velocity point down. And drag the last keyframe's velocity point up. Now when I play this back, we have an animated title that smoothly zips in and out. Okay, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching and I hope you found it useful.